Are you sure this is what she wanted? Yes, absolutely. I must say, sir, I don't think that she is going to fit. The slim line mahogany casket is what she wanted. She even wrote it down so I wouldn't forget. I can see you that. You say it's her dying wish. I'm not denying that, sir. It's just it's a matter of measurements. Hmm? Huh? The slim line mahogany casket utilizes something that we like to call thin. 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 The opposite of your wife. That's not my wife. Are you sure? Ever! <laughs> Are you done? Yes, thank you. Sorry to keep you. No sure. problem. What if we buttered her up? Buttered her up? Yeah, took a pound of butter, we rubbed it all over, and then we just slide her in. That's not very dignified. But it could work. Why don't we just slather her in motor oil and use a giant shoehorn? Mm, I'd rather try the butter first. You know, people don't like to think about it, but there is an element of practicality when purchasing a casket. Such as? Well, fitting for one. She was most insistent. She is dead. Your point being? It would be the wiser if we just plopped her into a size up. Oh, I couldn't do that to poor Ethel. She wore everything too tight. She wore shoes too tight, her clothes too tight, her cars too tight. To put her into a normal size coffin would deny everything that she was. Which was? A raving loony. Still, I don't want her haunting me, so stick to the plan. Well, we might be able to deflate her a bit when we prepare her. Ooh, you can do that. Well, it'd be something. It won't be much, though. What if she were naked? Pardon? If we took off all her clothes, it would make more room. She didn't say anything about what kind of clothes she wanted to wear. Are you planning to have an open casket funeral? We thought it'd be best for the kids. Yeah. You might want to reconsider. At this point, people viewing the body will be subjected to what can only best be described as a gelatinous beached whale stuffed into a sardine can. Her eyes will be bulbous, her lips pursed like a goldfish trying to give a hickey. Mm. Her face will be surrounded by several extra folds of flesh crammed into the box. Mm. Her general body shape will be square and she will be naked. Not appropriate? Not exactly conducive to the type of reverence for an event of this type. What if we put her head in a jar? Her head in a jar? Yeah, we put her head in a jar, put the jar in the casket, and people could say goodbye to that. To a head in a jar. You got a better idea? Why not a memorial? What? No body. Nobody? I want people to come. No, your wife's body. It doesn't have to be there. People just sit around and remember. Remember what? Where they put the body? No, your wife's life. You think about what she did when she was alive. Oh, no, we want people to forget that. So why do you need the body? Evidence. Evidence? Oh yeah, that she's dead. Nobody liked her. I didn't like her. Her friends didn't like her. Oh, the bullet holes in her head? Birthmarks. 